And finally tonight, hospitals can be a scary place. And for patients who have to stay there for a long time, finding ways to stay happy can be tough. Insights Aja Shreve shows us one prescription for putting a smile on patients. No matter how funny they are, sometimes get well cards just don't cut it. Hello, yes. We're volunteers and we're uh, have our dog with us. Would you like a visit? Instead, meet Daisy, a yellow Labrador retriever ready and willing to lift the spirits of patients, visiting family, and even the staff in the halls of the VCU Medical Center. Yeah, you know, when we walk in uh, into a room or into a visiting area with the groups of people, it's, it's fun just to look around the room and see everybody because they're focused on Daisy. Daisy is part of Dogs on Call, a therapy program from the Center for Human-Animal Interaction. Daisy and 30 other dogs in the program come to the hospital at least twice a month with their owners to spread good cheer and restore normalcy to the lives of patients. Aren't you beautiful? In order to join Dogs on Call, Canada dogs have to be over a year old and go through a series of tests. Daisy joined the program only a couple weeks after her first birthday and has since become a vital part of the Dogs on Call team. One of the top dogs in the program, Daisy was selected to be Miss May in the 2011 Dogs on Call calendar, which the Center for Human-Animal Interaction uses to fundraise. Proceeds from these calendars and donations are the Center's only funding for its programs, including Dogs on Call. Daisy and the other dogs make more than 500 visits a year to the VCU Medical Center. These trips include petting, nuzzling, and some, like Daisy, even showing off their tricks. The center uses visits like these to further their clinical, educational, and research goals to show the beneficial health effects of the bond between humans and animals, some of which can't be measured. I think uh, to have a visit when uh, patients such as I have other concerns helps a great deal because it allows you to take your mind off your troubles, as it were. It's, it's really a, a wonderful experience. It cheers us up. And, and it, as, as it's been said, if uh, the folks get uh, half as much out of the visits that we do, it's been successful. After a successful day full of helping others, and maybe a few passes of her business card to new patients, Daisy finally takes some time for herself. For VCU Insight, I'm Audra Shreve. Daisy, her owners, and other dogs on call teams will be at the Hounds for Healing Dog Walk on Saturday, April 23rd in Monroe Park from 12 to 3. All proceeds will benefit the Center for Human-Animal Interaction at VCU.